That's some wildlife out here already. Big jackrabbit. It's like the little garden area they got growing out here. Some more of that garden area. We've got something going on over here. I think there's another turn group over there. They just didn't pick some random rocks that they used to grind their corn rocks and chip them out. I would have found one that was up there. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's really <laughs> waist high. Over there, sat on the ground. Uh -huh. <laughs> this gentleman showing showed me his walking stick he made out of the swar rib. What's your name, buddy? My name is Peter Hugo. Peter Hugo. Thank you. Yeah, I ran and got a got, guy got out to the Desert Botanical. Got a, oh, about 50 different flutes. Oh, yes. From, okay, I'm showing you this because we're coming up on where they're, they've got a, an oven dug in their dirt over here, a pit, and they're burning their clay. Or baking them clairs, is it? I guess they've got some bulls in there they're bringing up. And when they're heated up, they sort of change okay, the process. The pit so, now. like this piece was all this orange color when it started. There wasn't the paler areas or the black areas that came out during the firing process. And some of that might go away with the pottery they brought up. But they'll retain basically those colors. Now, where was it? It's at um, Arizona State University at the um, Museum of Anthropology. And that's going to be opening closer, October 11th get this way. year. Okay, we got a little bit closer there to get down there. That, that one come out looks like a piece of art that just cooked on this. Came out really nice. Yeah. better if we just kind of go inside um, and I am getting hungry so I do need to eat a little bit and then I can come back out here. Oh you've got some? Okay.